So boys and girls, we've been getting a lot of questions on how do you get those old season exotics. The exotics from season one, season two, and after you unlock the season three track, where can you farm these exotics over and over? So if you've been looking at getting the exotics from season one, season two, and then of course, re-farming exotics for season three, well, don't worry, this video has you guys covered. And I'm gonna answer every single one of your questions, so hopefully you have none after this video. But before we dive into this video, let's thank our sponsor of this video, my partner, Advanced GG. I've been partnered with them for a few months now, and when I tell you their product not only tastes really good, it's very effective, and they hold nothing back. They don't keep any secrets from you on the label. You will see exactly what every ingredient is. They're very transparent, and that way you can look up what you are taking. Now, if you guys wanna try this product out, use skills at checkout to get 10% off your entire order. Now, there will be a link in the description, so if you guys wanna check that out, remember, skills 10 at checkout. So we know we have the Mantis, which is the current weapon I have now. This was actually a season two exotic. We have the Coyote Mask, which was a season one exotic. We also have the new Backfire weapon, which is a season three exotic. We have the Vile Mask, which is one of those fan favorites for status effect builds, which is a season two exotic. And then the new exotic, the Memento Backpack, which you get from this season. So once seasons are over, how do you get the exotics? And that's the biggest question. So we know we're on season three, so where do you get season two exotics? Like this Vial Mask we have right here, and then the Mantis, and season one exotic, like the Coyote Mask. Well, these exotics now can be found in the open world. You can now target farm these. Remember, you do have to have Warlords in New York to have any of the season exotics, but once you have Warlords in New York, and the seasons are over, you can actually just look for the mask. So say if we were looking for the coyote mask or the eclipse mask, well, we will look for the mask symbol. And as we don't see it in the DC area, well, that's when you're gonna have to go to New York and in the New York area, you can find it. You can see right here, it is a mission. It's Liberty Island. So that means we would need to farm Liberty Island to get the mask, at least this week. Now, another easy way to farm for these exotics or get kind of lucky to get exotics in general is doing the weekly shade project. Now the weekly shade project is just a donating project. Sometimes you donate electronics, sometimes you donate titanium, sometimes you donate parts. So there's different things you do have to donate, but once you donate that once a week, you can see I can do it, redo it in 11 hours, you get one exotic. Now not only that, you also have the weekly legendary mission. So once you complete your first legendary mission, this will pop up as a project and then you can do another legendary mission once a week and you can also get an exotic cache. So those are probably the two easiest ways to get exotics at the moment um, if you're looking for those exotic caches. Now, another great way is doing your leagues, yes. So you always have these leagues that pop up during the season, and when they do, you have two weeks to complete a league. Now, at level nine, sorry, tier nine, you get one exotic cache. Now, you have two weeks to complete this. It's a pretty easy exotic to get, especially since in those two weeks, you only have to get um, the amount of points to unlock that tier. Now, you also have on the season track, right? So whether se whatever season you're in, as you just saw right there, we got two exotics because we got one from the free track and then we got one from the paid track. And then there's also more exotic caches through the paid track and free track as you guys complete the season. As Right here, there's another one on the paid track. So that is another way to unlock exotics. Also, you have global events. So during global events, the same thing. At tier nine, you get an exotic cache. So that is another way to get you guys another exotic cache. So all these events all have a chance of getting an exotic cache, and then season one and season two will be in those exotic caches. Now, the only exotics that aren't in those exotic caches are going to be the new exotics. So once the next season comes, then those get added to that. So where do you go if you do unlock the new backfire and you do unlock the new exotic backpack? Well, once you unlock it, those exotics should be added to your open world targeted loot. So you look for the backpack symbol, you look for the SMG symbol. Now these symbols right here are gonna be the symbols you're looking for to farm those, right? Because it's targeted loot. So the big takeaway guys, remember, season one, season two exotics can be targeted farmed. Also, you can get those from the exotic caches as rewards, whether you're doing your daily or your weekly on projects, whether you're doing your season three rewards track and you get those exotic caches in there, that can all be found there. Now, if you're looking for the current season, as we are right now, we're talking about season three, the backfire and the momento backpack, well, those have to be unlocked first and then they will be thrown into the targeted farming um, of your open world. But you can't get those from exotic caches just yet. So that's just something to keep in mind. Now, if you guys have gotten the exotics 
from season three, any other way that I said that I didn't mention here, let me know in the comment section, guys. I do want to say thank you guys again for all the support. Hopefully, these answered all your questions about getting those season one, season two exotics that you guys have been looking for, and then for future season exotics in the future. I will see you guys in the next Division 2 video, but until then, nothing but skills is out.